welcome back to the Moran family. So today's video is going to be a maternity haul. I placed a pretty decent sized order from Shein. This was actually my first like time ordering from them. So I was a little nervous about it. I hear mixed reviews. Some people like rave about them and then other people say that like the sizing is off and the quality is bad. So I took my time when I placed this order. I just read like all the reviews. I looked at pictures. So hopefully everything works out. I did get like a few things that are not maternity, but should still be bump friendly. So this is going to be a try on haul too. So I'll show you guys all of that stuff and how it looks with the bump. I haven't tried anything or even looked at anything. So this is gonna be kind of like a first impressions as well. So the first thing that I got is this dress in this really pretty maroon color. So the sleeves have a ruffle detail on it and then it's just like a basic baby doll shirt. So this looks like it's going to be like bump friendly 100% all the way until the third trimester. I am five months pregnant right now so the belly is getting big. I've definitely popped but I can definitely see this working all the way until the very end like i said i'll try on everything so you guys will see it here in a second but this feels like it's really good quality like it's not see-through it doesn't feel like too thin too thick but it feels really good i accidentally ordered two of these so i do have another one next thing i got is this dress right here and I'm a little nervous for it because it's out of my comfort zone. You guys know I typically wear like black clothing and like graphic tees. I don't really wear like too many dresses. And when I do wear dresses, I don't really wear like form fitting dresses. But I've been really into like tight fitting dresses that show off my baby bump. It's summer, it's like 100 degrees where we live, so it's so hot. So I'm pretty excited for this one. So it has a halter neckline. And then, like I said, it's really form-fitting. This part right here, hopefully this isn't too big. I kind of steered clear of getting like dresses and tops that are like spaghetti straps because out of all of the reviews that I kept reading on Shein, the number one thing that seemed to be inconsistent with sizing and it just didn't fit right seemed to be like tops and dresses with spaghetti straps. It just like all the reviews weren't that great for stuff like that because they said like the tops were too big and then the bottom fit good. So I kind of steered clear from spaghetti straps. So the next thing that I got, and I'm pretty excited for these. I feel like Benny's not gonna like these ones, but I got some biker shorts and these are maternity. <laughs> Your face, you don't like them, huh? <laughs> They're funky looking. So these are biker shorts and it's in a leopard print. So a little out of my comfort zone again. These feel a little thin, but they don't look like they're see-through. So that's a good thing. And then these go over the bump because they are maternity, like I said. So hopefully these fit good because I plan on wearing these with like a black graphic tee and then some like bands, just some sneakers. So I think that'd be a really cute outfit. So this one is also like that first dress that I showed you guys, that maroon colored dress. So this one is just the black one. So this one is actually a set. I kind of want to say this is a PJ set, but I mostly got it for the bottoms because I've really been into like the whole biker shorts with graphic tees look. And I was on the hunt for some black biker shorts, but they were out of their maternity biker shorts in the color black. They were just completely sold out. So I ended up just going with this set because this set comes with plain black maternity biker shorts. So I figured I can just, you know, get the biker shorts from this. And this set was like really inexpensive. The top says love peace on it. And then it's just a black oversized tee. You guys know I love my like plain oversized t-shirts. So here are the biker shorts. These actually look really big. So I'm not sure how these are going to fit because they look massive to be honest. But I think these go over like your entire belly. 
So hopefully these fit me. Again, they don't seem like they're see-through, which is really good. So the next thing I got is a top. This print is a print that I normally wouldn't gravitate towards, but this top looks so cute on the model, so I wanted to try it. It's just a floral print, and then the front of the top is actually longer than the back of the top. It's kind of like a one of those peplum, peplum tops, I think that's how you say it. Next thing that I got is actually a skirt. It looks a little short now that I'm seeing it in person, so hopefully it fits. This is maternity, so it kind of has like a little ruching detail on the side. I was really wanting a just basic black skirt that goes over the bump. That way I can maybe wear it with crop top or like not my t-shirt. So the next thing I got is a shirt, but it's in that same maroon color as the first dress I showed you guys. So it's just a basic maroon tee. And then the bottom of it has a knotted detail. So just a basic tee. And the quality of this feels really good too. Like it's super soft, not too thin, not too thick. I also got another set. This is a PJ set. So it's a tie-dye set. So here are the bottoms. Again, this is maternity as well. So the bottoms are just pink and white, tie-dye, super cute. And then the top is the same print. It's just a basic tee. So that was everything that I got from their maternity line. So everything else that I have to show you guys is not maternity, but I still ended up going with my normal size for the most part. So the first thing I have to show you guys, and I keep seeing this on social media and I wanted it so bad, it's just a oversized t-shirt and then it has butterflies all over it. It says butterflies in my stomach. This feels so soft. I read all of the reviews on this shirt and they said to get your normal sizing or even size down if you don't want it too oversized. I just ended up getting a small and this looks like it'll still fit my bump probably all the way until my third trimester because this shirt is very, very oversized. But like I said, I did read the reviews, so I just went with my normal size. But honestly, when I'm not pregnant, I can probably size down in this for an extra small because it looks really oversized. But I am five months pregnant, so that should fit me probably all the way until the end. The next thing I got is actually a crop top. So I'm gonna have to see how I like it. I saw this really cute like outfit online. I think I was watching like a YouTube maternity haul and this girl styled a shirt just like this with that black skirt that I showed you guys. So that's why I got this top. So I'm gonna have to see how I like it. So it's just black and then it has sunflowers all over it and then the bottom ties so you can actually like pull the strings down here and make the shirt shorter or longer so it's totally up to you so hopefully that fits me because i think it would be a really cute outfit this is actually like my last top to share with you guys i did size up a lot in this one because again i did read the reviews and this was more of like a cropped tee but i didn't want a cropped tee I wanted like an oversized look, so I sized up a lot in this one. My normal sizing is like a small to medium, but I got a large in this one. Color is a little brighter than I would like, so I'm not sure how I'm going to like this one on. I feel like on the website, it was more of like a mustard yellow color instead of just a straight up neon orange color, but I believe they had a ton of other colors in this, so if I like this, I might just get just the black one, just to stay in my comfort zone. The next things I have to share with you guys are actually bras. So I'm not gonna show you guys how these look, but if you're curious on how they fit, just let me know in the comments down below and then I'll get back to you guys. So I got two different sets. So the first set comes in a pack of three. So there's a black one, a gray one, 
and then a white one so this came in a set of four so again this is more of like a bralette so there's no clasp on the back the padding on this is a little thick but you can just take it out if you want to so the reason why i wanted these bralettes is because i don't have any bras that crisscross in the back and i need stuff like this for whenever i wear like halter dresses like that purple one that i showed you guys so it came with a black one a white one this really pretty blue color and then a mustard yellow the last thing that i ended up getting from shein are actually some sandals like i told you guys it's so hot outside so wearing tennis shoes all the time is just not working for me anymore so i ended up ordering these ones and i've actually already tried these on and they fit perfect so i read the reviews on these sandals and they did say at least size up half a size so i normally wear like an eight eight and a half depending on the type of shoe so i ended up just getting a nine in these and they fit perfect these feel like they're going to last a really long time they felt comfortable it felt like my feet were supported so it just looks like these kind of look like birkenstocks but i've never had those so these are like just knockoffs like the look of them so they're just black foot bed sandals anyways guys that is everything that i got from shein so my overall impression of shein is just definitely read the reviews um i would try to steer clear from like spaghetti straps especially if you're not like top heavy like me because a lot of the reviews for stuff like that said it just it does not work because the sizing is a little off on stuff like that so that's why I didn't really get any spaghetti strap stuff. But overall, I would definitely order from Shein again. The shipping was really fast. A lot of people seem to have issues with their shipping, but that wasn't the case for me. It took about, I would say from the time that my order got processed to getting it, it took like nine days. So it was not long at all for me everything feels like it's really good quality so definitely my tip for you guys if you plan on placing an order with Shein is just to read the reviews but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up make sure you guys are subscribed to the moran family and make sure you hit that bell that way you guys always get notified every single time we upload and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys Never up, never die